question number one so for n 6n divided by n minus 1 is equals to 25 over n the first thing you're going to do is to cruise multiply so we're going to do it like this 6n times n which will give 6n squared is equals to 25 multiplied by n minus 1 let's open the brackets so you get 6n squared is equals to 25n minus 25 when you look at this equation you notice that this one will give um, a quadratic equation and all well organized so we organize this we get uh, 6n squared minus 25n when you take 25n to the left hand side we get that when you take negative 25 to the left hand side we get plus 25 is equals to 0 now you notice now this one forms a quadratic equation there's so many ways of solving quadratic equation you can use um, factorization and also you can use the quadratic formula so I'll go with the quadratic formula now since you cannot simplify this further 6 25 and 25 we don't have a common factor so the quadratic formula is like this and will be given by negative b plus or minus b squared minus 4ac divided by 2a now you identify a b and c so a this question will be 6 b will be negative 25 and c will be positive 25 now substitute these uh, values a b and c in this um, formula so you get n will be given by negative b this will be 25 plus or minus then the square root uh, this will be b squared b negative 25 squared minus 4 times a a is 6 times c which is 25 everything divided by 2a 2 times a a is 6 that will give 12 let's simplify this we get 25 plus or minus so the negative 25 squared will give 625 then when you multiply 4 times 6 times 25 this will give 24 times 25 which will give 600 and then everything divided by 12 we continue 25 plus or minus 625 subtract 600 you get 25 everything divided by 12 so working out this further the square root of 25 will be 5 plus or minus 5 then divided by 12 so n will be given by the first value when because you get 2 will give 25 plus 5 which will be 30 divided by 12 and uh, this one when you simplify it you get um, oh, divided by 6 you get 2 sorry then this will be 5 30 divided by 6 you get 5 12 divided by 6 you get 2 so this will be 5 over 2 which is the same as 2.5 that is the first value the second one will be n is equals to uh, 25 subtract the first one you've taken 25 plus 5 now the second one will be 25 minus 5 which will give 20 divided by 12 I simplify this um, 12 divided by 4 you get 3 20 divided by 4 you get 5 so this will give uh, n will be 1 and 2 thirds so these are the two values n is equals to 2.5 and n is equals to 1 and 2 thirds